Welcome to Lisa's Littles. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today is Monday. Happy Monday. I am here with <laughs> Mimi and Emma. And Mimi is already starting looking off in the other direction, but that's okay. We're just going to let her go until she gets tired and falls asleep. Hopefully she doesn't fall over. She likes to fall over a lot on my bed. Anyways, happy Monday. I hope everyone is having a great day. I am here with Emma and Mimi. And we are here for Whatever Monday and Cheeky Monkey Monday. Isn't that right, Mimi? She says yes. So, I just couldn't help myself, you guys. I put Emma in the strawberry outfit. And even though it is size three to six months, and looked huge on camera. As you can see, it actually fits her. And what I find very odd about these outfits is that the shirt fits perfectly. There's a little bit of wiggle room with the shirt, but the actual romper is like big. I never understood how a set that goes together could be such different sizes. I don't know. I don't know if it's just me or whatever, but I found that to be with not just this outfit, but other outfits I have bought that were supposed to be sets. The shirts seem to be like perfect fitting and then like the <clears throat> romper or overall seem to be a little bit big. I guess maybe that's because it goes over the shirt and you need a little bit more room. I don't know. Anywho, I have Emma here in the vintage strawberry romper with the matching collared strawberry white shirt. And we decided to pair it with a big red bow to symbolize a strawberry on her head. Mimi's going to sleep. So the outfit is white with little red flowers little red polka dots, and a whole bunch of strawberries. And on each side of her waist is a bright red bow with white polka dots. And I think that she just looks absolutely darling in it. And on top of that, I figured what goes better with a vintage strawberry outfit than my strawberry shortcake vintage sheet. So we put that down as the background. Oh, Mimi woke up. Are you finished? I think she's finished. So I decided to put the sheet down. Guys, I was gonna keep just my black background down so that the colors of her outfit were really pop, you know? But I was like, what better thing to put her on than the vintage strawberry shortcake sheet? So that is what I used on top of the black background that I usually use. But yes, there she is. There is Emma for Whatever Monday, and there is Mimi still in her Disney onesie for Cheeky Monkey Monday. Also, I just wanted to let those of you who requested a Valentine know that the cards did go out in the mail today, so they should be getting to you within the next two or three, maybe four days. And if anyone else would like a card and didn't email me yet, please feel free to do so. But I think I'm only going to mail them up until this Friday, which is the 10th, because I'm afraid if I mail them that late on the 10th, you will not get them by Valentine's Day. So other than that, guys, I'm super excited. My mail has not ran yet. I'm making this video, my mail has not ran yet, so I'm hoping that the rest of my items come today. I do know that three of the packages are getting delivered today for sure, but there are three more that still say in transit, and I know two of them were supposed to be due today, but I guess they're being delayed, and then one is due on the 8th. So I may do two separate haul videos, I may do one for tomorrow for Tuesday's video. Um, if I don't, then I will probably wait until everything comes in and I can do one haul video for everything. So that may be Wednesday, 
or Thursday, possibly even Friday. I know it will be this week. I'm just not exactly positive what day. And I don't know if I want to split the haul in half or just do it all at once. And then there is one person who I bought from on eBay who is irritating me. Um, she had a lot of baby clothes that were vintage and I put in a bid and she accepted it. Well, I guess an offer. I put in an offer, she accepted it. She messaged me after she accepted it and she was like, if you pay right now, I can ship it today. Well, I didn't get the message because I was busy that day until about three hours later. So I messaged her and I said, I'm sorry, I just now got your message. I paid, when will you be able to ship it? That was on Thursday. No, excuse me, that was on last Wednesday. Thursday went by, Friday went by, Saturday went by. I messaged her again on Saturday and I said, hey, just curious as to when you're going to be able to ship because on her uh, shipping thing on eBay, it says shipped within 24 hours after receiving payment. So that is why I asked. I still have not heard back from her and it is Monday. Uh, two more days will be a week. I'm getting kind of irritated. I want the stuff because there are actually two sleepers, sleep and plays that are in the original boxes. And then there are some other uh, vintage items and I really do want them, but it's starting to irritate me that she wanted payment right then and there, and then she could ship. And then once I made payment, she just didn't answer me back. <laughs> That's the one super irritating thing about eBay is when the sellers do not answer you back. That is what irritates me the most about eBay. I love the stuff on there. I love that you can make offers and sometimes get stuff for, you know, pretty cheap. But whenever the sellers don't answer you back, that is what irritates me the most. So hopefully she answers back. I know it is a lady because she said that her name was Connie, I believe. So everyone else that I bought from, and I bought from about seven different people, all of them answered back. All of them have already shipped. She is the only one that has not shipped and has not answered my messages. So yeah. I'm gonna give her till Wednesday. I'm not gonna say anything else again till Wednesday. I said something on Saturday and she never answered. So I'm gonna wait till Wednesday and I'm gonna say, hey, it's been a week since I've paid. Are you going to ship? So yeah, I really hope she does. Anyways, guys, it is Monday and we are just here kind of chilling and hanging out, not doing anything. I was just too excited. I had to share that super cute outfit on Emma. But I think that that is it for today, you guys. So with that being said, that's going to do it for this video. Emma, Mimi, and I hope you enjoyed watching it as much as we enjoyed making it for you. And until next time, bye, guys.